Up, oh, I'm recording. What was that? I am on a new computer setup. This is a program that I only recently started using. Well, I used the mobile version. You saw that like last uh, uh, last year, I believe. It was 2020 when I. No, no, it was actually 20, uh, 2019 when I first showed off the fact that I'm using like Medi Medibang Paint. Uh, Medibang. Rather. Okay, I'm gonna play some music. Music! And for once, it's music that I made myself. Okay, so this is going to be one of the thumbnails for a video that I'm about to make. Okay, uh, I'm about to draw one of the hands. Make... Make this bigger. Okay, so... The hand is facing like this, right? So, the arm is like this. Hmm. The, the arm. like ideally the ar the arm is like this so that means that means the hand should be facing like this I think yeah that looks that looks fairly correct. Yeah. And the, and the thumb is over here. That means the index finger is here. And here. And the pinky is here. And I'm pretty sure Okay, that's a little... Okay. Let's try that again. Um, it's more like... Like this, right? So the arm is like this. That means... It's more sideways. More facing towards the front. More facing towards the front than to the side. So that, that means the flat plane is going to be more like this. Since the hand is basically just a box, right? So uh, that's where... And the index finger is here. And the pinky finger is here. So index finger, let's go. And I can get away with uh, donut fingers by just no not uh, with hot do hot dog fingers rather by just drawing them really thick and making it so that it's she's obviously wearing gloves. And most of her hand is obscured by. And most of her hand is obscured by the the Albert anyway. So. Not that big of a deal. Okay. Smaller hand. Let's tr let's draw this glove now. I tried drawing this freehand, and if I continue to fail, I'm just just going to automate it. Uh and if you if you people are wondering, yes, I am still drawing with a mouse. All of, uh, all of those speed paints of me drawing with a mouse, those are still uh, those are still the case. I have not changed my methodology. 
Although, uh, this, although the fact that I switched to Metabang did help, uh, did help make my art look way more professional looking. Uh, there, there's just something about like, uh, there's just something about Meta, uh, Metabang, uh, you know, like size by pressure and for, force fade in out, like. As far as I'm aware, this is the only program that uh, that let that lets you do shit like this, like with a mouse specifically. Uh, let's set that back to seventy. Like all of the other programs that I've tried, uh, they have pen pressure. They can simulate pen pressure, but their dynamics just prevent it. Uh, Prevent it from like uh, detecting whether or not uh, the the way they set up their dynamics is that they can never figure out uh, how how long how long a pen stroke is supposed to be. So you have to manually set it every time, and that makes that that makes me really sad because I wanted to like Krita. Krita has a lot of features that I think I would have liked better than. Uh, it has a lot of features that I think I would have liked, but unfortunately, uh, I just had needs that uh, so far Metabang has been the only program to really, really fulfill those needs. Which is odd. Since I don't really see, see many people talking about Metabang. Especially for the people who say like, do you want to draw with a mouse? Like I see videos of people who, who I see I see videos where they're talking about uh, drawing with a mouse, and and it's always like, uh, and it's always like you, uh, and it's always just like uh, what what is it? Use the curve stool to make curves, to, to and it's like, like. Like I get it, uh, I get it. You, uh, most most people most people can't draw like most people can't draw smoothly with a mouse. That makes sense. But like, what about the people who can't draw smoothly? What about the people who can't draw smoothly with a mouse? Uh, where are the resources for them? Uh, this isn't very clear. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna cheat a bit and uh, just freehand the I'm gonna cheat a bit and just freehand the index finger. Will that look good? That's not gonna look good. Uh... Yeah, fuck it. I'm just gonna ignore. Uh, I'm just gonna freehand all of it. I'm uh, gonna for the opacity of all of these. Okay, let's try that again. So it's like... It's like this, right? For the pinky? Like that for the pinky, so that means... And I have to draw this, draw this. Will that work? Okay, yeah, that works.
Okay, there's that. I'm gonna end the I'm gonna end up drawing the entire hand, aren't I? Yeah, no, I'm not I, I'm not dumb. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna draw the parts that are that are that I actually have to draw. So after So this part, okay let's pretend, and then one last, go like this, and then like this. Delete the parts that are obscured by the halberd. And that smaller. So Okay. The, the thumb is one of the hardest parts of the uh, hardest parts of the hand uh, because of how it's supposed to connect to the hand. Or at, le at least that uh, at least it's the hardest in my experience. One thing I will say, uh, it feels really good to have like a uh, to have like a an easy to use shortcut, an easy to use shortcut for changing the size of your brushes. Uh, I'm pretty sure that GIMP had had it too, but eh. And that. I guess I have to delete this as well. What's great too is the fact that I can use my right click for for something other than just like uh, an options menu. Okay, which one is that? Okay, it's layer six. Those lines. I'm gonna have to make some edits to this. I just realized that the this cuff here doesn't look right. Okay. Okay. And delete that part. I only have like 40 minutes of music though, so don't expect a long video. How... Okay. 
There we go. Okay, that's good. Now for the legs. Oh, golly, the legs. Can you control the... Oh, the legs. The legs, the legs, the legs. Okay, so I move... So these these were this is where the hips were before. This is where the hips were before, right? Let's, let's increase the opacity there. <clears throat> these, this is where the hips were before. I moved the hips back slightly and made them a little bit bigger uh, to make to make them more like to make them more like uh, in line in line with this. So. So what would that make her standing like? So her standing would be more like this. Her standing would be more like this. Which, which come to think of it, uh, uh. Because like uh, when when you look at this like tech the like like when you look at this like her head her head and her chest like the original one uh it was her head was back and mo uh her head and most of her body was like slightly behind where her she would have tipped over uh. She would have she would have tipped over like this. So I have to move. Uh, so this leg, I have to move. I have to move this. I have to move this to the left. So where's that sketch here? There's the sketch layer. Uh, what was the? Was it the rectangle? What was the lasso tool? L. So this, I just have to move. Move this like this, I suppose? So if I move that like that... Okay. Okay. I can I can move the leg. I can move this leg backwards. I can move this leg backwards, but uh, it obs it obscures her silhouette a little bit. So what so what ends up happening is like so what ends up happening is like uh, this is her hip, right? Uh, that's where her hips are. So it becomes like this and like this. In the box. And uh, just to make sure. Just to make sure. Um, and one of her hips is right over here. One of her hips is right over here, and it's perfectly straight. Perfectly straight here, right? Supposed to be? Yeah, that's where the center line is. So, her heel is right where her... Okay, no, the heel should be slightly behind. The, s the heel is slightly behind the center of gravity. The toe is slightly in front of it. 
And that should be good, right? And not to mention the fact that she has like this whole this this whole uh, halberd thing, like uh, tipping her over like this way. Okay. Okay, I'm confident with this now. Let's draw. Oh, I just realized this is what this is literally the. I just realized this is literally the song that's go uh, that's going to be. That's the. This is literally the song that I'm go going to use this arc for. Okay, I need to make. Okay. Is this acceptable? Is this acceptable? Yeah, sure, it's acceptable. Okay, uh... But would it be more acceptable if I started from higher up? Okay, yeah, this is... this is good. And it's so much easier to do, like, uh, lines like this. It's so much easier to do lines like this when, uh, your lines are already, like, uh... I'll already taper automatically. Okay, how do I... Wait a second. You can hold control and alt to change the brush size. Oh, it's... It's, it's not actually that... It's faster, yes, but like... It's faster if it's... Larger movements are faster. Uh, if... If I have to make a large change, I'll use that. What was... I need the curve tool. Curve tool for the boot. I, st I should download the thing that I had uh, had on my old computer. Uh, the w I, ne I need to download the thing that I had in my old computer that allowed me to like showcase my keyboard. But if I showcase my keyboard, people will not be able to see. People won't be able to see the drawing. Huh. Good for thought. I'll have to think about it. Okay. Okay, draw that. Yeah, no. <laughs> Fuck that. Not. Fuck drawing that manually. I'm not doing that.
Okay, draw this. Okay. And here. Where is the... Where would the buckle be for this one? And... Here, right? It would be here. The buckle would be here. Okay, so... Uh, I'm gonna need to make it a circle. God, why do the circle tools look wor- Why do the circle tools look way worse than the regular tool- uh, than the brush tool? That's eh, fine. Whatever. Okay, so... It's larger. Those. Okay, undo. There's some things I need to undo. Okay, yeah, here we go. And then here, delete these. Okay, there we go. There this. There we go. And where is the line? It is. There we go. Save that. Okay, save. How the fuck am I gonna do the legs? Okay. And... I kind of want her to have like, have like a drink or something, like something for her other hand to do instead of just ha have it be like something for her other hand to do other than just like stand limply to her side. Since it's like it's just obscured by her the entire other side of her body. Like I need I need to have an idea. Like if it's like, if it's like a juice box. If it's like a juice box, it's like, you gotta be holding it.
Okay, the juice box has to be proportional to her hands, which means the juice box has to be bigger. Which means the straw can be bigger. How big is a juice box usually? Isn't it around the size of your face, right? Like it's around the size of your face, so this is this is acceptable. This is acceptable juice box size. So now I just have to like Now I just have to like freehand her freehand her holding the juice box. Oh god, I have to freehand her hol holding an item that's small. How do I normally hold juice boxes? I'd, nor I'd normally hold them like this. So, uh, forget that. Uh, forget that. I'd normally hold them... So... This should be... A this would be fairly accurate to how, how I normally hold them. I, I, I'd hold them... Uh, I'd hold them like this. Like a... Hold them like that. But wouldn't that mean like... Wouldn't... But wouldn't that mean... Uh, wouldn't that make it more... Uh, make more sense if the juice box was like... Was like this? It was like this instead? How the fuck do you hold juice boxes? Okay, so juice box like this. I just ma make the juice box like the size of a can. It's like this. Just erase that. And I suppose... It goes like this. Like this, right? It, it, it would be like this, but... Okay, so first things first. It would be like this, but it, the arm would be turned this way. So uh, I need to draw that... I need to draw the arm a bit more. So let's try that. And I'm also noticing, yeah, okay, it's proportional. 
I don't need to worry. And the hand. Okay. So like this. Okay, I think I figured it out. So that's this is this is the one of one side of the box, right? One one, one side of the juice box. One side of the juice box. Okay, this side. The other side. This is where the thumb is. Okay. God, I have no idea how to draw this fucking juice garden. I have no idea how to draw this stupid juice garden. Why did I decide to draw this? Why did I decide to draw this? Come on. Okay, that works. Okay, that works, I suppose. Right? This is this is where this is how juice gardens are constructed, right? I I am so dearly tempted to just look at a reference for a juice garden, but I don't want to put in that effort to just look at a juice garden. Fuck it, this is good enough. This is good enough, okay. So
I'm gonna have to change how the what the mouth looks like. But that's fine. Uh, how do I delete? I should make a shortcut for delete layer. For now, I have to. Oh right, I still have to draw the foot. Fuck me. Yeah, I'm one of those weird people who have more trouble with feet than have more trouble with feet than most uh, the hands. Uh, figured out how to do hands fairly I, I, I've figured out how to do hands like a couple a couple years ago and ever since then like uh, the only th uh, I've been I've had more trouble with feet the problem with this layer. Yeah, that's acceptable to me. How long have I been recording? 40 minutes. This video is about to end. Let's just say that. I'm gonna draw the legs. I really don't want to draw the legs, but I have to, so I will. Eventually. Okay. Okay, so the this is the ankle, right? That means the heel is here and the... Uh, the heel of the foot is here, and the ball of the foot is around here. This is the toe. Around here. The toe should be around here. So that means... So that means like... Uh, so make the ball of the foot there. And the toes are here. So theoretically, like, uh, the boot, the boot would look like this. Theoretically, the boot would look like this, with like... Like, uh, since, since she's supposed to be wearing winter boots. But, her, okay, maybe her leg, uh, her foot would be, wouldn't be that big. And if her foot isn't that big... I can reliably just make make the boot exactly like this. Huh. Okay. Draw okay, first draw the heel. That's the heel. Draw the other part of the boot. Draw the bridge. I'm so very glad that I decided to give her boots instead of a shoe. Yeah, that's good enough. And yeah, that's good enough.
come on. This version of Terminal... Uh, wait, no. The previous version of Terminal Terminal and this version of, uh... Scrapyard of Dreams is slight di slightly different from the other ones in on YouTube right now. Better mixed, for one. Come on. I am s Yeah. Yeah, fuck this. You fuck this. Use use the curve tool. Can't be Can't be asked to perfectly draw the contours of a foot. small lines there. Very small lines. There we go. Next up. I guess draw this. Draw these. These more visible, I suppose. Come on. And just that. This isn't going to... This is probably not going to look right, but it's a boot. People are probably not going to be looking at the boots too much. There's too much detail, I could just remove the detail. Come on. 
And... I should erase those parts as well. These are not gonna look right, but uh Yeah, yeah, these will be fine. I'll be fine. go and let's put another circle here this oh this 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 is another remix of uh along the overcast sidewalk this is made by a friend of mine Damn beautiful. I'm so, I'm so I'm so happy that they made it for me. I'll deal with it with the shadows. The shadows can deal with that. Oh boy, um... Yeah, draw that. And... How, how long is this? This is around the same length, right? Yeah, this is around the same length. All right, let's let's draw. Okay, that's unfortunate. There we go. Oh dear, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to draw over all of this. Oh no. Okay. Eraser tool. This is a song that's going to be in This is a song that's gonna be in Sonic World. One fan. Any of you are familiar with the anime that I uh, that are popular in my circle? You know exactly what the song this uh, what song this one is based on.
count is this? It's like at least four. How many is this? One, two, three, four, five. Five of them. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Come on. I think I'm done with. Okay, I'm almost done. I'm not quite done, but I'm almost done. Uh, there's literally just the arm left. Uh, there's literally just that extra arm left. Uh, I think I can delete this. Literally just this left. Uh, I just need to draw this. How long have I been recording? Uh, 58 minutes. Okay, I. Okay, I'll finish this. Uh, uh, there's there's one more song that I want to. Uh, I I should play at least one more song. Uh, let's see. No, uh, let's play that. Okay. Okay, there we go. I could, I could, I could probably finish this in two minutes. Finish this in the amount of time it takes for the song to finish. And if I can't, that's fine too. And there we go. Ok, 
Okay, there we go. There's something I'm missing. Okay, yeah, there are some things I'm missing. So, delete these. This almost done. And is there anything else? Uh, I suppose something like this. And I need this. All right. Go and write a bunch of lines. All right, I think we're done. Okay, only took an R for this. For this to become mostly done. Wonderful. Let's let's wrap up. An R three an R four minutes. Yeah, th this is a good recording session. I'll see uh you'll probably already have seen this one. Uh see seen the video where this thumbnail is used, but for now, this is what we have.